All right. I just want to talk about L bracket tension for a second. This is the way you should see them if you have proper L bracket tension. <clears throat> With a switch made up, such as this, there should be a gap here between the L bracket, bracket and the contact finger. See how there's an air gap between the L bracket and the contact finger? That means the spring is putting some pressure on the finger to the contact. It's not touching the L bracket. That means there'd be no tension on the contact. Does that make sense? Contacts are straight up and down. They're not touching the contact fingers. And there's no gap between the contact finger and the L bracket or the or the contact finger and the and the uh, barrel of the switch. That means when the switch rolls over, this contact finger will come out a little bit and there'll be a gap. Same with this. There'll be a gap. All right? That's L bracket tension. You have to have uh, new operators. You should always check it. Anytime you're overhauling an actuator, make sure you check it.